When we're able to take really our most creative people and really sort of focus them into a whole bunch of sort of what if scenarios, just you know, totally dreaming, you really start to look at things in a totally different way. Taking away all the limits and restrictions that we have today and really looking at what we can really do in the future. Thinking beyond what's possible, thinking about the impossible and perhaps making it possible. If you would have attacked a, a new driver in a traditional way, you would never come up with anything close to what we came up with. You had to have a face, you had to have a connection to a shaft, and it had to be able to contact a golf ball. That's it. If we could eliminate any user adjustability and the club could adjust itself, what would that look like? The concept that a club can change during the swing is a pretty radical concept. It blew my mind the first time I saw it. Wow. <laughs> it's badass. It looks technical. It looks mean. What the hell is it? What does it do? Moad is the mother of all drivers. What happens if we had a golf club that had active arrow that could actually steer the club as it's coming down through your swing? It's pulled together at address, and then as it's coming down, this thing opens up and just gives you the maximum MOI you could ever dream of. Mid-swing, you're out of plane, and all of a sudden, the club reacts. It's knowing its own flight path. It wants to adjust, whether it be a little open, a little closed. So when it meets that ball, it, you are hitting it perfectly square and getting a great shot. And then you also have this piece that goes up and down this way, which would move the center of gravity higher or lower. And the idea wasn't really just, let's create an illegal driver. Let's just see what we could create. This project was interesting in, in the way concept cars are to the auto industry. Those technologies and those design cues find their way back into the market products. So unless you really test the boundaries of what you're capable of, you're never gonna see those things appear in the market.